We are at the W.M. Browning Cretaceous Fossil Park. It is off of Highway 45, just north of, north of 30, uh, near Frankstown. If you go till 30 until it dead ends into 145, you turn left and then you go up a few hundred yards and turn left again where it says airport and it'll bring you right to this. You can see the bridge for Highway 45 right there. We're in North Mississippi. We came down this pathway right here to get down to the stream and as you'll notice we are exactly under Highway 45 right where it crosses or close to where it crosses Highway 30 and so now we are going to proceed northward we're going to go in that direction right over there this is north of the parking area it's starting to level out and to get a lot a lot rockier and a lot less muddy Tell me, can is it okay for me to put you on youtube i don't care what's your name my name's robbie hey robbie tell us your design for well it's 12 See. by 22 okay you use quarter inch hardware yes i use pool noodles and i also use a pipe inside it okay i got you uh rip a half inch right off the bottom of the one by that way it supports the wire okay gotcha and that way Put you don't two try bolts on it make it to where you can tie it off or hold on so it don't float down the creek right right and then it also turns into a pretty good carrying handle right <laughs> so. and that way uh unlike mine you don't get so much silt every time yours uh automatically filters the silt out a little bit faster cool Bobby McCrory. And I'm Tony Crow. Okay, tell me what you just said. Uh, well, we come up here digging and we look for silt with gravel like that. Like this. Yes. Over there. Yes. And we also concentrate around old fallen stumps and logs. Okay, gotcha. Dig down and under. Right. Because most people won't. Right. And we found much better teeth and a lot larger teeth. Okay, under those spots. Because it's trapped them. Right, trap some under there. Cool. Charles is going to put some silt in this and now just pan it for a little while and let's see what we get. Okay, all right. I keep panning it until all of that sand gets out of there. Okay. All right, I'm look through the rocks and see if you can find anything. Okay. Okay, here we go. Hold on a second. Okay. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, do you see that guy? Mm -hmm. That is a shark tooth. And that's what you're looking for. Not quite so easy to see. Good job, Charles. <laughs> Show me what you have out of this set, Melissa. I found one that looks like it's almost pretty much intact and then another broken one. Nice, what'd you find, Charles? I'm still working. Did you find one in your hand, though? Uh, I put it in my packet. Oh, here's one. Uh, part little, of one. Little piece of one. Cool. We're finding about two or three for every two shovelfuls. Okay, your destination of the Frankstown Fossil Dig is at the junction of 45 and 30 in northeast Mississippi. Out here, Got a good, beautiful picture of the full moon. If you listen real close, you can hear the drone and the small engine airplane in the background. That's kind of what you hear. The whine of a truck out on 45. I believe 45 goes from Tupelo to somewhere. I see one coming. When you get to this intersection, you can either go straight ahead, turn left on 145, and then immediately turn left 
on when it when you see airport this way and that will take you this direction up here or you can do like this car that is about to exit on to 45 north go down or go up 45 north until you get to the first crossroads turn right and immediately right there into the bridge is the fossil site it's not called the frankstown fossil site i can't remember the name exactly right this second but that's where you are heading